In this tutorial, we will set up CZM and Google Maps in Unity after signing up for them in the previous tutorial. Open Unity Hub, click on New Project, and select the 3D URP Core Template, and then download the template if prompted. Select a project location and give it a name. Let's call it 3D Maps. Then click on Create Project. In Unity Editor, under the Edit tab, select Project Settings, then Package Manager. Now let's create a new scoped registry. Add these details for the name, URL, and scope. I'll put the details in the descriptions. Then click Save. Under the Window tab, select Package Manager, then choose Packages my registries. Select CZM for Unity, then click Install. Select Yes to the warning to enable the backends and restart the editor. A new CZM tab will appear after the editor restarts. Click the CZM tab and under CZM, select Connect to CZM ION. Log in to CZM if needed. Allow permissions, then close the Internet Explorer window. OK, open the Google Maps platform, select Get Started, and ensure you are signed in with the right Google account. Go to the Keys and Credentials section. Under the API keys, click Show Key for the API key that we set in the previous tutorial, which was 3D Viewer. Select Copy to Clipboard. We will use this key as a token in Unity. In Unity Editor, under the CZM tab, click Token, tick Specify a token, and paste the token in the token field, and click Use as Project Default Token. Under the CZM tab, click the plus sign for the blank 3D tiles tileset. A CZM Geo Reference object will be added to the hierarchy. In the hierarchy, expand the CZM Geo Reference object and select the CZM 3D tileset. In the inspector, under the CZM 3D tileset section, tick Show Credits on screen to comply with Google Privacy Policy. For the tileset source, select from URL and add this URL. I'll put the URL in the description. Make sure you replace the API key part with your Google API key. As we have seen earlier, you can get the API key from Google Maps platform in the Keys and Credentials section. Under the API keys, click Show Key for the API key, which we named 3D Viewer in the previous tutorial. Then click Copy to Clipboard. Let's paste the API key here. Press the Enter key. After that, Google Maps will appear in the scene. Great. Let's set the start location that appears when the user plays. In the hierarchy, select the CZM GeoReference object. In the inspector, under CZM GeoReference, we need to set the values for latitude, longitude, and height. Let's get these values from Google Earth. I will start by setting the unit to a format we can use in Unity. Go to Tools, Settings, formats and units, and set the latitude longitude formatting to decimal, and click Done. Search for a place in Google Earth. I will look for Town Hall Sydney, for example. Right-click on the place, select Get Info, right-click on the numbers. This will copy the location and elevation values. Let's paste these values in Unity. The latitude value will be in minus because it's in the south. Let's also use the elevation value. Now we can orbit around in the scene.
and when we reach the desired position, go to Hierarchy and select the CCM GeoReference object. In the Inspector, under the CCM GeoReference section, click Place Origin here. Notice that the Earth-centered coordinates are added for the new origin. To add a dynamic camera that will help us navigate and orbit in the play mode, under the CCM tab, click the plus sign for the dynamic camera. Let's delete the main camera then. In the hierarchy, select the main camera, right click and delete. To make the scene run faster during play, in the hierarchy, select the CCM 3D tile set. In the inspector, under the CCM 3D tile set, Set the maximum screen space error to a value like 45, for example, to make it run faster. A low value will cause a larger number of tiles with a high resolution to be loaded, while a higher value will result in a lower resolution but faster performance. Click play and use the WASD uh, keyboard combinations and the mouse to navigate around the scene and move around. Great! In this tutorial, we learn how to add Google Maps 3D tiles in Unity. Next, we will learn how to add our 3D objects to this 3D virtual world.